And today we're going to and today I'm going to show you how to make a fancy candy. So <coughs> to spice up your Halloween. First, you're going to need a bowl. Yeah. And then you, you can use any eyeballs you want. They're pretty cheap at the dollar store. Um, they're pretty cheap at the dollar store. They come in a variety of colors. You got your traditional, you got your colored, and then you got your large. So I'm going to be using the large. This is great for little kids. Um, I wouldn't use um, hot cuckoo around them for um, safety purposes, but just regular works good. So you have to find the front of your bowl, technically over here, and you just cuckoo a pair of eyes on. Uh, today we're going to do a spider, because um, spiders are great. Oh yeah, this is my guest. This is Karinky, my associate from my own lair to your TV. So, this is Frankie. Yeah, I know. I just said it. Great. Spiders, I'm telling you nowadays, you can't play, 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 play. You can't play without them. So, um, you want to put two regular eyes on here. Then you're normal. You better take that back. Spiders, am I right? I am captain of this show. I just invited you here just to be nice. Don't mind the don't mind him. He's a little um, under the web, under the weather today. So today's last episode. Halloween is in three days, and. This is my last time of seeing you guys. All the projects that I've done in the show, they're all Halloween related and it's just a way to spice up your Halloween and make it a lot better. So. This is the amount of eyes you're going to need. And now we're going to do legs. You're going to need pipe cleaners. Uh, doesn't matter what color. I decided to do black and silver. It, again, doesn't matter. You're going to need eight legs. I definitely recommend the hot glue for this one, because with or even tape, that'll work too. But more specifically, duct tape might work a lot better. But there's many ways you can do this project. I prefer hot glue because it stays on there longer. 
So you're going to need eight of these. This will be a good candy bowl to put outside. Or you can use this as a punch bowl. There's many uses for this project. Unlike the other project, they only have one use. Now we're going to do the other side the same way. Then after this project, I'm going to show you another way how to do this project, cause which will be good for trick-or-treaters. Again, you can use tape if you don't want to use hot glue. Uh, I would recommend tape with pipe cleaners if, as an alternative. Um, <coughs> I just happen to have hot glue, so it was my decision. You be quiet over there. Morning, you. Don't mind him, folks. He's a little Final leg. And there you go, you got your legs for your magnificent spider. Yeah. Now you would, this is optional, and now you would want to do the pinchers. It's easy, we just curl the pipe cleaner. And cut the ends, the pencil. Now you just add it beneath the eyes. The 
This is a very good project, very quick. This is great for kids. Um, I definitely would recommend it. And there you go, you got a candy bowl. Dressed up as a spider. <laughs> now, for trick-or-treaters, Now for trick-or-treaters, you're going to need a basket. They can do any creature they want. So I'm going to do a monster because I think it'll be cute. And we're going to use the color dies. Doesn't matter. This is all in the fun. Again, this is random mortar. Uh, you don't have to do Rambo. This is good for um, Halloween parties for children. This is a fun craft, and right after you can go right to trick or treating. Why not just put a smile on? Because why not? If you want to add arms to the basket, why not? Pipe cleaners, you can do anything with them. I used to love playing with these as a kid. You can just attach these to the handle. No glue required. If you're using hook I recommend to um, unplug it if you're doing this tutorial. For safety reasons. Yeah, no glue required. You just attach it to the handle. There you go, you got a little monster for your trick-or-treaters. That's it for the show. Thank you for joining me for Fantasy Crafts. Have a great night, all. Happy Halloween. We're done. <laughs>